An invasive insect called the, spotted called the spotted lanternfly has arrived in Indiana. Indiana Public Broadcasting's Rebecca Thiel reports it poses a threat to wineries and orchards in Indiana and across the country. Spotted lanternflies feed on grapevines, hops, and several kinds of trees, including many fruit tree varieties. They also produce a sticky, sugary substance called honeydew, which can attract mold and other pests. Jim Butler co-owns Butler Winery and Vineyards in Bloomington and says he's been watching the invasive species spread west. He says universities on the East Coast are researching the spotted lanternfly. And they have to figure out the life cycle and when, you know, when do you attack it? What's the best way? What can you do to stop it? So that, they're still working on that. We're just hoping that's figured out before it becomes a major problem here. While Indiana has more than 100 wineries, Indiana State entomologist Megan Abraham says it's especially important that the state keeps the insect from spreading to much bigger wine producing states like California, Washington and Oregon. So some of the biggest concerns for Indiana honestly are going to be in continuing to make sure that our trade um, goes unhampered um, out of Indiana towards some of our western states. Abraham says spotted lanternfly eggs are easily mistaken for mud on things like RVs, carrier trucks, and freight trains, so it's important to clean vehicles going in and out of the state. The adult spotted lanternfly is grayish with black spots and bright red hind wings. Its nymph is bright red with white spots. If you see a spotted lanternfly, contact the DNR at 866-NO-EXOTIC. For Indiana News Desk, I'm Rebecca Thiel.